Hey, welcome to Aerotech. Today we are going to explain about top most advanced aircraft carriers in the world. You see we posted a short about why runways are not flat and there was a lot going on with aircraft carriers in the comments section. So, we thought we will do a video about it. Now let's go to the video. Number 10. Chakri Narobet. HTMS Chakri Narobet is the flagship of the Royal Thai Navy in Thailand's first and only aircraft carrier, although the RTN refers to her as an offshore patrol helicopter carrier based on the Spanish Navy's Principe de Asturias design and constructed by Spanish shipbuilder Bazan, Chakri Narobet was ordered in 1992, laid down in 1994, launched in 1996, and commissioned into the RTN in 1997. The ship is the smallest functioning aircraft carrier in the world. Chukri Narobet has been deployed on several disaster relief operations, including in the aftermath of the 2004 Indian Ocean earthquake and tsunami, and in response to separate flooding incidents in late 2010 and early 2011. Number 9. Cavour. Cavour is an Italian aircraft carrier launched in 2004. It is the flagship of the Italian Navy. The 134 meters, 2,800 square meters hangar space can double as a vehicle hold capable of holding up to 24 main battle tanks or many lighter vehicles and is fitted aft with access ramps rated to 70 tons, as well as two elevators rated up to 30 tons for aircrafts. Cavour was laid down by Fincantieri in June 2001, and it was launched from the Riva Trigoso shipyard in Sestri Levant on July 20, 2004. Number 8. Sao Paulo. Sao Paulo was a Clemenceau-class aircraft carrier in service with the Brazilian Navy. Sao Paulo was first commissioned in 1963 by the French Navy as Foch and was transferred in 2000 to Brazil where it became the new flagship of the Brazilian Navy. The aircraft carrier Sao Paulo was built in France between 1957 and 1960 and served in the French Navy as Foch. In September 2000, it was purchased by Brazil for 30 million US dollars. Number 7. Vikramaditya. INS Vikramaditya is a modified Kiev-class aircraft carrier and the flagship of the Indian Navy. It entered into service in 2013. Originally built as Baku and commissioned in 1987, the carrier served with the Soviet Navy and later with the Russian Navy before being decommissioned in 1996. It was commissioned on November 16, 2013 at a ceremony held at Sivirotvinsk, Russia. On June 14, 2014, the Prime Minister of India, Narendra Damodar Modi, formally inducted INS Vikramaditya into the Indian Navy and dedicated it to the nation. Number 6. Charles de Gaulle. Charles de Gaulle is the flagship of the French Navy. The ship, commissioned in 2001, is the 10th French aircraft carrier, the first French nuclear-powered surface vessel, and the only nuclear-powered carrier completed outside of the United States Navy. It is named after French statesman and General Charles de Gaulle. As of July 2021, Charles de Gaulle is the only non-American carrier vessel that has a catapult launch system, which has allowed for operation of F-A-18E-F Super Hornets and C-2 Greyhounds of the U.S. Navy. And the ship carries a complement of Dassault Rafale M and E-2C, Hawkeye Aircraft, AS-365F, Dauphin Pedro, EC-725 Caracal, and AS-532 Cougar helicopters for combat search and rescue, as well as modern electronics and Aster missiles. It is a Catabar-type carrier that uses two 75MC-133 steam catapults of a shorter version of the catapult system installed on the US Nimitz-class aircraft carriers, one catapult at the bow and one across the front of the landing area. Number 5. Queen Elizabeth. HMS Queen Elizabeth is the lead ship of the Queen Elizabeth class of aircraft carriers and the fleet flagship of the Royal Navy. 
capable of carrying 60 aircraft including fixed wing, rotary wing, and autonomous vehicles, it is named in honor of the first HMS Queen Elizabeth, a World War I-era superdreadnought, which in turn was named after Queen Elizabeth I. The carrier Queen Elizabeth carries its namesake ship's honors, as well as her Tudor Rose Adorned crest and motto. It began sea trials in June 2017, was commissioned on December 7, 2017, and entered service in 2020. Her first seagoing commanding officer was Commodore Jerry Kidd who was appointed in 2014 but did not take command until May 2016, having previously commanded the carrier's Ark Royal and Illustrious. Number 4. Shandong. Shandong is a Chinese aircraft carrier that was launched on April 26, 2017 for the People's Liberation Army Navy of the People's Republic of China. It is the country's first domestically built aircraft carrier and second in planned service after the completion and commissioning of Liaoning, from which it is derived. Shandong's class was initially suspected to be designated Type 001A but was revealed to be Type 002 at its commissioning ceremony. Shandong was constructed by the Dalian Shipbuilding Industry, part of the China Shipbuilding Industry Corporation, in Dalian, Liaoning Province, China. The aircraft carrier's design is largely based on China's first carrier Liaoning, and the first sea trial of the carrier took place in May 2018 in the Bohai Sea. It is the flagship of People's Liberation Army Navy. Number 3. Kuznetsov. Admiral Kuznetsov is an aircraft carrier serving as the flagship of the Russian Navy. It was built by the Black Sea Shipyard, the sole manufacturer of Soviet aircraft carriers, in Mikhailov within the Ukrainian Soviet Socialist Republic and launched in 1985, becoming fully operational in the Russian Navy in 1995, and it is the flagship of the Russian Navy. Number 2. Improved Nimitz Class. The Nimitz class is a class of 10 nuclear-powered aircraft carriers in service with the United States Navy. The lead ship of the class is named after World War II United States Pacific Fleet Commander Fleet Admiral Chester W. Nimitz, who was the last living U.S. Navy officer to hold the rank. With an overall length of 1,092 feet and full load displacement of over 100,000 long tons the Nimitz-class ships were the largest warships built and in service until USS Gerald R. Ford entered the fleet in 2017. Number 1. Ford Class. The Gerald R. Ford Class is a class of nuclear-powered aircraft carriers currently being constructed for the United States Navy. The class, with a planned total of 10 ships, will replace the Navy's current carriers on a one-for-one -one basis, starting with the lead ship, Gerald R. Ford, replacing Enterprise, and then eventually taking the place of the existing Nimitz-class carriers. The new vessels have a hull similar to the Nimitz class but introduced technologies since developed with the CVN-21 program, such as the electromagnetic aircraft launch system, as well as other design features intended to improve efficiency and reduce operating costs, including sailing with smaller crews. This class of aircraft carriers is named after former U.S. President Gerald R. Ford, 14, the first ship of the class, CVN-78, was procured in 2008 and commissioned into service on July 22, 2017. The second ship of the class, John F. Kennedy, is expected to be commissioned into service in 2024.